it's potentially not the easiest pick to find because the bands are quite on point. There's no DK already because it's picked. Puck Tiny were taken up all around, so they do have a very good lane to just like chill. And I mean, the hero is very similar to Sven. You just do want to farm as El Misha with a little blood grenade action. Is he diving this? Has he got oh, it? He is. Oh, he's, he's got it. Hey, he's under got it. tower, first blood's coming. El Misha probably going to survive this as well. Wait, doesn't he just want to die now? He's going to have to walk back to Fountain anyway. Yeah, I think it's turned on by two heroes, forced away. And a flame break up top. Oh, I nearly gave the opportunity for Collapse to get the crush in. And Pony Cable to step away. And actually, oh, Wudo and Snare dragging the Batrider back under tower. Damage from Pike's Lena, not quite enough. And Collapse, yeah, able to force the Lena back, save Mira's bat for now. Another Blood Grenade, though, and a Dragon Slave thinking about oh, it. Pike gets it up, lines it, takes down the bat. And they're even looking for Collapse here as the secondary kill. He's pretty speedy. Oh, and Snare reel in. reeling it back in. Light strike array, the stuns for days, damage is coming, and Pike, he's got enough mana for that Dragon Slave to finish it off with a double kill. A three right. for nothing laning stage victory here in both side lanes. Yeah, easy clap, nerds. What's up? This is just what, like, what do you, oh, Meposhka. Oh, Meposhka. <laughs> Feel the burn. Uh, he's nearly dead, barely surviving thanks to Mira and Lyle's arrival. Oh, Lumpy nearly slices him. And the Chakram here, level 5 Lyle, that's the situation we're talking about. Lumpy's yep. hit level 6 before that Storm Spirit takes him down. Mira gets a trade, but it's still 4 for 1, and it's the Team Spirit calls that are dying. Oh, the body I mean, blocks. This is... Oh, nice, Lash nice. with the body blocks. Oh, can't quite stay in front of him, but Lumpy with a Chakram. Oh, I don't know about this. It just needs a bit more damage. Got oh, him. the Whirling Death comes back up. <laughs> This is just full-on SA Top lane again? Shut up, Kezu! There's more people <laughs> dying! Collapse! He's in trouble! No, he's not. Never mind. JK. Uh, uh, if, Kezu, you were good, you would have, yeah, if you were good, you would have known he wouldn't have died, so... <clears throat> but it's okay. You can interrupt me. Let's be long. It's like more on... Where can, like, your supports move, and do you have any gate rotation? So I think for now, mm. just mainly the supports. Maybe they can go here to Lumpy, look on the runes, and oh. yeah, hits. Yeah. He traps the Storm Spirit, but Mira and Lol, they turn on moves. Some revenge finally in that mid lane as Lowell bottles up the haste and is even looking to chase down El Misho. I'm thinking about it. And the team spirit brought three in there. Like you're definitely the mid and the safe lane. So maybe he can like go mid or maybe the timber can go somewhere. So they're, they're like very open in terms of how the map can be played. Well, another move up top. And how, how many is that? Four from Beast Coast? Yeah, these... It's Tim Saw and Leshrag just stomping all over the place. I mean, these are the heroes we were saying, or you were saying in the draft, a lot of damage. They just need one stun to connect, and it's, yeah. it's death for Team Spirit. Like, here, Moose, he's going to chase forward. Does he have a snare back up? He does to drag the Batrider in towards Lumpy. El Misho able to catch up now. Lena wants a bite of this pie as well. She'll try to get it onto this Storm Spirit, but Storm's here with the Dragonite. Takes down the Naga Sire, and Lena trying to slip back through the Northern Passage as the rest of them... Lesh lost to have people said you are Lena Stun, Timbra as well, as Mira TP spot. This is a level 8 primal. He's you better have some fancy footwork. Uh, uh, yeah, some fancy wing work as well. I don't know if you can flap over the cliffs and try and get away. It looks like Mira's found a spot there. A bit of safety from the primal beast, but it's not safety from the timber saw. He cuts down the trees. He goes through the canopy, kills off the bat rider. It, this is just, this is, you said it two minutes ago, right? Classic the way the chance for Miposhka to sit behind one of his cores makes things very difficult to, you know, try and hold on to the mid-tier one and defend it. They'll go straight on him as well. And yeah, Miposhka just, he's being a walking ward at this point. He's scouting, see who's there. The Storm Spirit will zip over. Miposhka does survive. At least gets himself out of danger for now as Radan and Lol maybe looking to strike back. The little piggy Naga Siren going to get stunned up and controlled. There we go. Okay, I thought maybe Beast Coast could, like, disengage for Spirit. Yeah, but it's like... How, how do you make these moves before the blink on Slaughter? Yeah, it it will have to be with like... Like bat smokes and just lasso someone, but he's still level 5. And, he, and, and he's also dead. dead. <laughs> Hard to lasso people when you're dead. Because he's... Yeah. I think he's not even close to 6. Like he... Just look at these dire heroes swarming top. Oh, Collapse, you're close to your Blink Dagger, collapse, are you? Are sniffing this one? I don't think so. He does not see it coming, and his Raindrops will offer little protection against the onslaught of damage that comes his way. <laughs> Looks like Vitaly also slipping out of the grasps of the rest of Spirit down at the bottom <laughs> what, river. What do you feel here if you're Mira or Mapochka? <laughs> collapse dies and he uses the voice sign of Subdiff, what can you do? <laughs> yeah, I don't know, man.
Oh, that's a good snipe. Oh, the storm takes so much damage from the edict and the onslaught. Chakram, I'm coming in onto my Poshka. Timber Ching, Lumpy, trying to, trying to get in there, but they'll go with the Primal Beast. Slap down instead. Just hold on to the spells of the Timber. With the, the Chakram facet, you already have so much damage, you can set yourself up with that too. And that's another Wisdom Seal. Oh, jeez. He's going to die for it this time, though. Yeah. So at least they do get the kill because, yeah, they are... They're bleeding XP. Mira is still not level 6. JK, he is level 6. Just forget about their own. <laughs> Yoink. Oh, that's well, his. that's at least very good for Spirit because, yeah, any kill for them right now is, like, really big. You're down 4k gold. You need XP. You need to, like, try to come back because, yeah, they're going to need one or two kills to... Oh, Mr. Moose. We'll be on the Down receiving end once more. Yeah, my dad on the hunt now. Team Spirit, find a snipe. Forcing a reaction out of East Coast as they do get in on top of the Slardar. A lot of damage dumped his way and collapse. And hands his life over for an unstoppable streak on this Lena. Mira having the Blink Dagger, so Beast Coast need to make sure that they don't overplay their hands. Because, like we're saying, they're up 4 5k gold, but this game can turn very quickly. Oh yeah, it's going to come down to these team fights and how they execute it. As they go in, the Primal Beast starts on Miposhka. Omni Knight, the main focus here, and he is dispatched with quickly, and they got the Storm caught up. All netted and slain quickly as Team Spirit lose two heroes and they are on the run. Or worse for wear. Let's see how and they disengage, if they do. I mean, Lumpy. Oh, Pike, the Lena, she's shown the jump from Mira. Lasso is there. Storm Spirit comes in, but the My Song of the Siren, is that protection enough to try and save the oh. Lena? Pike is barely surviving, gets up to high ground. The tower hit. Oh, he cracks the whip, the miss up hill, but the Storm Spirit zips on in for the kill. Now the Nargis are in trouble as well as Team Spirit. This is what they are so good at, picking their moments and striking back. Oh, this is this is pretty devastating for Beast. He, actually, he nearly lived, but Jump, she's still dead. If you pop BKB and there's a corrosive haze, you may still not be able to fight back. So it's going to be a lot about what can they do on their primal, as Mr. El Nisho is probably dead. Yeah. He's down there trying to push out waves. I'm kind of like, what's the next play? Is it wait for Team Spirit to, to make a mistake and fall into a trap? Because I don't see that happening when they're the ones just running straight into your northern jungle. Song of the Sirens here to try and trap the storm. We'll see with an onslaught and an ensnare if they can bring down Lal. Light Striker is there. The damage is coming and Lal, first life down. Aegis claimed up. Aegis. And also Beast Coast yeah, just backing up. They don't want that continuation. Collapses in though. A stun onto Lumpy. Lol with his BKB showing what he can do. Split Earth not really going to connect there. And they've got a lasso on his Primal Beast now as well to drag him away from safety and into danger. Was that a Daedalus on Red? Does DK just have a full uh, Daedalus? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> so where did that 1k crit come from? Ah, right. That's a hard one. And they're trying to make a move across. The Dire Scan doesn't connect on anybody. And who's that? Primal Beast TPing to tier 2. The jump is there from Team Spirit, though. Oh, just See immediately <laughs> killing the Primal. And now El Misho. He's on the menu as well. Radan charges forward. Lumpy getting Flame Break back. But he's got the Timber Chain to get to high ground, at least. But that's your tanky offlane. Oh, and, and Moon is Nagasara. And also dead to the BKB of the Storm Spirit. Like a tanky Primal Beast just disappears in a, in a second. So they're going to go is... for a kind of Hail Mary and just hit the Roche. It is so risky. Uh, they're not doing that much damage to it. Like you said earlier on, they're not the best roche taking lineup. Especially not when they're being contested by Team Spirit, oh, who have rolled Giga all the way around in behind the roche pit. Smokes are breaking, flame break misses, and the Naga Illusions yeah, causing a bit of difficulties here from Spirit's attempt to initiate. Onslaught going to miss completely, though, and the Timber Sword's going quite deep. In comes Collapse. They found the Lena. The opening is there, and Team Spirit, they found their man. Pike is dead. It looks like Vitaly's going to follow him into the grave. Six feet under now as Lumpy is bumped around, but does TP back to Fountain. And it's going to leave Roshan to Team Spirit, though. That will just all go on the backline and yes. just evaporate him. Yeah, it's incredible stuff. I mean, uh, at that, that point, though, you... Oh, hang on. We've got to kill on Laurel here. Mr. Laurel. They've got stuns. That Atos in the split earth. Perfectly timed. Like, you could see the storm could have lift his arms, getting ready to pull lightning. But yeah. Slax is doing, you know, the, the mouth instruments. Yeah, Slax is like the high skill one. Whereas, you know, Jenk is like the scuffed, ver scuffed the but skill. funny version. Yeah. Oh, oh they're they're the Lasso. Lasso into the damage of the DK. Lumpy oh, just disappears. Dead for 80 seconds. Now Primal Beast trying on the Dragonite, but does nothing. The Primal Beast, useless. 
This Dragonite, uh, he's, he's got he's got Aegis as well. 4,000 HP, Satanic Daedalus, Aegis. Good luck breaking through him. I don't know, yeah, what, what did Bilbo do? He, he didn't kill the dragon, did he? He just came in and, and stole some <laughs> some magical items. I'm pretty sure he he went for like a, a, a drive and run or a hit and run. Oh, or hit and run yeah. Yeah. Well, that's the final fight, isn't it? Primal Beast dead, slain by Radan. The dragon knight comes out with a double kill as he just broaches the base, kill. I mean, Leshrac, Leshrac's kind of a donkey, right? Uh, kind of. So we need El Misha to get out of his seat, go into Team Spirit's room and say, Yo, Toro, I love you. charisma check and say... <laughs> Okay, he's getting real him. him. Oh, reel him in. He's got no Aegis anymore. Uh, his Dragon Knight's still very tanky, though. Satanic and BKB still ready to be used. And you can <laughs> even see there, Radan is under no pressure whatsoever. Hands off keyboard, doesn't press his buttons because he doesn't need to. Yeah, he, <laughs> you're like, he has his BKB Satanic ready. He didn't even use it. He's just healing to full off of, like, I guess, Vlad's and his passive Satanic was giving him lifesteal. Four seconds, Mr. Beast Coast. Ooh. Monkey King. And then you get the blood grenade torn, like everything just high range. He does survive, but has to pay the price of a bit of a fairy fire, more region. Put on a leash a little bit. I stunned down bottom with the edict. Hey, Poshka. Oh, he's he's seen this story before. This Redan. guy's good. He's coming this guy's in. Good. Trying to trade. Has he got another leap? Another hit from the arrow? Not quite enough to take down the lash. But you can't lane anyway, and you lost yourself. And now you're stuck on one HP under tower, yeah. and Moose is dying. Regardless of this, he's got snowball, he's got shards. He's not going to get the kill on Mira. And look at this, lighting up the scatter blast. Where are you? Come back here. Die to collapse. I couldn't get having a great time in this top. To free up El Misho to move around the map. I mean, for now, it looks like they're trying to pressure Mr. Radan in the bot lane. He has another leap. And yeah, he gets over the trees. And Vitaly is going to slowly try and chase this one down. El Misho has been met by Miposhka. Looks like Rodan should eventually die. 30 seconds yep. on the leap charge is not going to have any chance of survival. Yeah, nicely done. I was not too sure if they could get this kill, but I think Maposhka was getting ready to like move middle and help on the roof. I will say that I... Oh, hold up, I can't say anything because Pike is... Dead. You said that perfectly fine. Yeah, but Lumpy, take it over Gary B. Oh, he's, he's hasted. The hasted monkey king. Yeah. Oh, I, I, he self juked. <laughs> the torrent after the scatter blast. Oh no, he's being kited so hard. He should oh, he still get this kill ward. though. <laughs> the he actually place. had to place a ward. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> and now they're trying to dive onto the tower onto Mira. Moose is here with a snowball and a good connection from Beast Coast. Now step up the pace and get the monkey king unlocked, enabling Lumpy to get a double kill. So important for them. They leave for Beast Coast. Uh, definitely relieving the pressure off of that top lane, at least for now. But is is this a lane that Beast Coast wants to... Well, hang on a second. Bottom Meposhka in trouble again. Vitaly and El Misho just slaughtering the Omni Knight. I was going to yeah. ask, is top lane even laneable anymore for Beast Coast? And looking at the map, they say no. Yeah, I think they're doing the right thing by not going top and just trying to bring it anywhere else. This yeah. is good. Yeah. Dive bottom, get a kill. Mirana leaps in, nearly takes down the Lash. A good pop of the wand or lotus, whatever that was, to keep El Misho alive. Moose, snowball, oh, five bit of time. Monkey King is in here as well, and you're right, Lal has got like 200 mana left. He's even less than that. Pops the wand, tries to get across the cliffs and saves him. Oh my god, Collapse just came in and saved the Storm Spirit with everything in his toolkit. Six. A little bit a little bit of slowing down of the match, though. A bit of a lull in the past couple of minutes. Bit. But now the action picks back up. See? We yap That's and we ramble, minutes. but the X mark into boat, Collapse. Comes in with a bit of a bang and a wallop, thanks to the, the Mortimer's Kisses, which turn into ice with his skin. He does have to spend the boat. Oh, lol. Yeah, finger on the trigger there. Gets away from Moose and Vitaly, who was stepping up in the mid lane. 14 minute runes about to spawn. And the DD is grabbed oh, immediately. Oh, brother. he fell for the trap. He's being hammered and walloped by the Primal Beast as the Kisses do land back in towards Moose and Vitaly. But they've sidestepped the majority of it. A yeah, good move from Pike at top side and like get a roach kill. At least for now, they've kind of found collapse. Yeah, it's a good kill. Yeah, stunned him down. Killed inside the Wukong's command. Uh, should, should relinquish control of that top jungle and maybe give a bit of space to Beast Coast to press into the mid tier one at the very least. But Lyle has other ideas. Aggression onto El Misha. Only Knight behind him gives the Storm a lot of freedom to do what he wants. And there's also a bit of dire vision in that bottom jungle. As the rest of Spirit, they're coming through the gate. 
Oh, Mira a bit late on this, yeah. yeah. First point of contact on the Snapfire. Mira gonna get slapped around a bit. Team Spirit wrapping in behind the Monkey King though and finding the ooh, snowball save. Buy some time. X Mark comes out of collapse trying to catch the Lena. Pike, can they defend the Monkey King with a Wukong's command? Trying to fight back into Team Spirit here. Lol just zips in and blows up moves. Pike turns Laguna Blade, but Radan so tanky with the back of the Omni Knight. They've got so much sustain, dodging the stun and now turning onto the Primal Beast to claim his life. Very scrappy fight, actually. I really liked how the sorry for Beast Coast. They had this aggressive board. Let's collapse. Yeah. That's the fine. A little shield rune for El Micho. Take over. Oh, sorry. I thought you were. <laughs> <laughs> El Micho. Yes, not El Misha. There we go. I just, I just made sure. You know, Perished. That, uh, when you take it harder again to catch them. Like you're getting a, a Manta on your Toro, which means the Gleipniers won't get him killed. You already have Storm who's very elusive, so they will once more have to think about like, ooh, hold on, Pike. Yeah, you know, only show. Being focused by Mimposhka and Mira, Pike dead to Radan. Lol, he gets right on top of him as the Snowball didn't quite come out in time. So Moose also gonna die. A double kill for the Marana, and it looks like it's gonna be even more as Lol zips over the top of El Misho and takes down a third such, but Lumpy just spamming out Kunkka has the hero facet high time. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, oh, El, El Micho. Micho. Uh, is he dead? Yep. Yeah, he is. Deceased. No longer here. Vanished. <gasps> Vanished. In heaven. <laughs> Collapse. Oh, they've got the high ground vision. Just in time to see the Lena and Pike. It's just the, the, the big kill there for Team Spirit. Out on the map, find the primary kill they want to, and they're pushing out other lanes at the same time. That's very yeah, smooth. And looks like that's just going to be Gate into Roche. And the game is reaching a the end? very critical state. Yeah, we're slowly heading that way. Oh, full bore misses. By it Mira. does. The kisses don't, though. They're all on the money. Thanks. Like, everything changes because if one dude builds a specific item, maybe it needs to change yours or it needs to change the way you need to play the map. As El Micho is getting pirated by Mr. Collapse. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, what do you want to call it? Sucker. <laughs> no, he's absolutely right. Yeah, he has, in fact, been pirated. Yeah. Rallied. He's been blackbearded. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's He's been red bearded. He's been grey bearded. Oh yeah, all the pirates just have. Oh my god! Oh, Ooh, hang on, snowball. Uh, they're still dead though, probably. Right? Nah, they're they're, they're fine. tidal wave. They are not fine. Pike is dead on my screen right now, and Storm Spirit will zip back to safety. Collapse and Lyle have oh, just one v 3 X mark back the Primal Beast into more damage, and Poshka arrives in from the left hand side. Uh, this is just a signal now that Beast Coast have very few options left to them yeah. when Lull and Collapse have this much freedom to do whatever the hell they want. Being toyed with a little bit. Can Collapse find him? He's trying, he's trying. He's got a, a kill on his oh. overward and the torrent lands on the Monkey King. Well, he jumps down, trying to fight this. Here is Lumpy as a backup of Moose and Pike, but a Marana, the damage output, incredible from Radan, and Collapse is still alive. Inside the Wukong's command, now blown up by the Lena, finally dead, but Radan with this damage output, shredding through them, Lol arrives on the scene of the crime, a double kill for your Marana, <laughs> Lash Rack in the pit, about to drop as we'll see the Tusk disappear. A five-man wipe is incoming, and Collapse, <laughs> we'll drop in the chat with your lines as he goes, oh uh, yeah, you got me, good job into the face of Pike as well. And high ground not broken yet, but I think the spirits of Beast Coast definitely are. Yeah, it's... Uh, this could be the last fight of the game. And if they run into Collapse, that would not be the target they want. Radan. Ooh, the Marana's a good one. Oh, Ooh, so much hell. protection. Oh, no. God. Oh. Hey, <laughs> look at him go. What? What? This guy, I mean, yeah, yeah, you just call GG there. I mean, there's <laughs> nothing else you do after that, though. Uh, 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 yeah. No, I respect it. You go all in, but herp derp, you know.